This is not going to work on any very few people. It's only going to work. He has to have this condition. You, you give him two, take it to the bar and order two glasses of water. This could be a sheet bait. Mm -hmm. So far. So far. And she drinks two. You say, have another if you have three. Now, what happens with all that water? Are you all with me? Her blood has become what? Hypotonic. Right? So what does she have to do? She's got to reabsorb more sodium and get rid of the water. She has trouble. You know what she can't do? She can't reabsorb more sodium and she can't get rid of more water. She stays hypotonic. If she's hypotonic and the blood goes past the brain cells, which are isotonic, what are the brain cells going to do? Which way is water going to move? From the blood to the cells. Blood is what? Hypotonic? But, you know, less particles, more water. Brain cells are what? Balanced. So water is going to what? Enter the brain cells, and they're going to start to swell. And they're not going to function. And she's going to feel now. Just had a drunk day because the brain cells swelled because she but could not but restore her blood to ISO to this. Really crazy. I said, so you ask, how do you treat someone like this? You bring her into the hospital, man, you worry. You know what they give her? It would be yes, this in a million ways. They give her, and it has to be kept in a separate room in the hospital. Hypertonic saline, not isotonic, but what? Saline loaded with sodium. And you know, a few years ago, I think, I don't, I don't want to say the hospital, 